Do you watch Game of Thrones? Seth Meyers may be hosting the Emmys for the first time, but he's not a first time host. When you were sworn in, you looked like the guy from the Old Spice commercials. Now you look like Louis Gossett Sr. You've done the uh, White House Correspondence Dinner. You're in a room of DC power brokers. Now you're going to be in a room of Hollywood power brokers. The thing about the White House Correspondence Dinner is not the DC power brokers, because I don't know if you've noticed, they don't really broker much power these days. <laughs> but being next to the president, I think, raises the stakes of the performance there. But hosting the Emmys, brings a different concern for Myers. The most nerve-wracking part is how many of my colleagues are there. You just want to perform well in front of people that you know and are going to see around afterwards. There are also some of the same people who could be targets in Myers' opening monologue. How is it different when the people maybe you're making some snarky comments about are right there in front of you? You don't try to make that much eye contact. <laughs> just like try to look right over their heads. And that's easier to do with six months of late night monologue practice under his belt. It's, it's at least taught Myers what to do with his hands. Going, what? In the beginning, the first few shows, it looked like I was trying to signal a passing plane. But now you got the choreography down. Yeah, just yeah. Keep, keep one in the pocket. The same place he hopes to put the Emmy audience. Oh, that went so Mark Barton, NBC News.